Hello guys, this is Glenn from Sydney CBD Repair Center and today we have a Google Pixel 8 Pro with a broken camera glass and we're gonna replace it with David here. Let's get right into it. So this one, we're gonna be focusing our attention on this broken glass only. We're not gonna open up the device through the back cover. So we're gonna slowly do it. We're gonna zoom in on some parts of this video so you can clearly see what David is doing. So right here, we're gonna start off with the main damaged area. You can also see that is made up of glass and you don't want to rush this thing because underneath the glass is obviously the camera glass and those are very delicate parts of the camera system so we're taking this bit by bit right there the adhesive is pretty strong it's just good for water resistance there we're gonna clean as we go the main camera I guess is exposed now we're gonna continue our way up to the right side so if you have this issue you can also do this on your own but if you don't have the patience and you don't want to risk damaging your smartphone even further or you don't want to have eye injuries because this can fling right into your eye if you're not very careful. So David is wearing protective glasses. He's not using gloves in this case because we need the precision. He needs to feel the depth of the chisel because he's using this tiny chisel to carve out the broken glass. And he's a pro, so he knows what he's doing. If you have the same issue, you can just take it to your local repair service technician. They can have uh, their own solution. But here in Sydney CBD Repair Center, we just take this route, remove it completely. As you can see there, very clean. No scratches whatsoever. And also, we're going to clean off the sides where the adhesives wear and of course the sensors make it clear and blow off some dust that may have entered and for now we're gonna test whether it's good or not as you can see there cameras are all good the zoom lens and the wide angle are all good. So we're good to put on this brand new camera glass. We're gonna do this one time and it's just gonna be easy right there. Put it on top and press it in because it's already got an adhesive and we're done. So I hope you enjoyed this guys. This is a um, finished repair just a special one for you this is a minor part but very important when you're using your phone as your primary camera so take care like and subscribe we'll see you again next time cheers if you want your smartphone fixed for a very reasonable price you may contact sydney cbd repair center we also provide mail-in repair services for customers outside of Australia or Sydney. Just message us so we can arrange the shipping of your device. And here David is having a really hard time removing this latch that secures the connector for the display. But he's taking, he's taking his time so not to damage the connector on the motherboard and he's finally got it out 
We have something that we need to remove from the old display though. And later on, we're gonna see what that is. This is our replacement display. There's some plastic on the back. We have to remove it, bend the connector. And then let's test it out. So at this stage, we're just gonna try if it works because sometimes replacement displays that we receive here in the shop can be defective or has some imperfections on the display. So David here is just making it, uh, making sure that the client gets a very good quality replacement screen. And while he's booting up the smartphone, he's removing the fingerprint scanner from the old one. You can see that there. So the fingerprint scanner for the Google Pixel 6a is located behind the display. So we're going to try to remove the sensor and transplant it to the replacement display. The connector is right here. So the trick here is to precisely position it to the cutout so that the smartphone can register the fingerprint. So the replacement screen doesn't come with this one because it's a, uh, another part that has to be taken into consideration when they deliver or price a specific replacement port. Now that's in, we're just gonna secure it with the heat resistant tape. And then at the top of the, this, this replacement display, we are also gonna transplant the plastic for the front camera lens. So this is quite a very uh, efficient design. You can see that at the front of the Google Pixel 6a, it's just mostly screen and that's a very good thing. 